Download this code from codegive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. Installing a Blender addon typically requires a manifest file, usually named underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot pi, which defines the addon's properties and registration with Blender. However, if the addon you're trying to install is missing this manifest, you can create a simple one to get it working. Here's how to do it step by step. Step 1, download or locate the addon files. First, ensure you have the addon files. This usually includes python files, .py, that contain the functionality of the addon. If the addon is distributed in a zip file, extract it to a folder. Step 2, create the manifest file. If there is no manifest file present, you can create one. In Blender, the manifest is typically incorporated in the underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot pi file. Here's an example of how to structure this file. 1. Create a new file named underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot pi in the root directory of your addon folder, where other Python files are located. 2. Add the following basic structure to the underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot pi file asterisk. Step 3. Adjust the addon code. If the addon consists of several Python files, make sure to import any classes, operators, or properties you want to register within the register function. For instance, if you have a file my underscore operator dot pi that defines an operator, you should import and register it in the register function. Step 4, install the addon in Blender. 1. Open Blender. 2. Go to Edit Preferences. 3. Select the Add-ons tab. 4. Click on the Install button. 5. Navigate to the folder containing the modified addon files, including your new underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot pi, and select the folder you may need to select the parent folder of your addon files. 6. Activate the addon by checking the checkbox next to its name in the list. Step 5. Test your addon. After installation, check the functionality of your addon within Blender. Look for any additional panels, operators, or features that the addon is supposed to provide. Additional Notes Error handling asterisk if you encounter errors when trying to register classes or operators, ensure that all dependencies are correctly imported and that there are no syntax errors in your Python files. Documentation asterisk always refer to the Blender API documentation for the version you're using, as it can provide specific details on how to work with Blender's Python API. Compatibility asterisk check if the addon is compatible with your version of Blender, as some APIs change between versions. Conclusion By following these steps, you can successfully create a manifest file for a Blender addon that lacks one, and install it in Blender. This can broaden your ability to customize your Blender experience with various tools and functionalities.